Hey everybody, welcome to our weekend check-in video for Psych 25 Human Sexuality for Saturday, October 30th. So just going to go over a few items and reminders as I always do. I'm sure you all know the drill by now. So first up is that your uh, current chapter on relationships, chapter 12, uh, that is due today by this evening, 11.59 p.m. I've already been getting a lot of your submissions and uh, many of you have some really interesting thoughts about can you have sex without love or love without sex in a relationship. So it's always makes it for a good discussion in my face-to-face -face classes and I'm really impressed by a lot of your comments in this online version. So uh, keep up the good work and uh, if you haven't turned it in yet, please make sure you do by this evening. Uh, next up, just a reminder that the next two chapters in our unit, because there are four chapters in this unit, you might recall, 6, 12, 5, and 7. So the last two chapters, chapters 5 and 7, uh, the quizzes and discussions for both of those are due next Saturday, November 6th. So make sure you've got them turned in uh, by that time there. You will get a reminder announcement, just kind of a heads up in case you didn't notice that they're both due at the same time. Uh, part of the reason is that we do have to cover Chapter 7, but I'm not covering that much. It's kind of a truncated presentation. I'm not going to really uh, have you go over pregnancy and childbirth so much, except in terms of how it relates to uh, sexual experiences and behavior, and also a little bit about infertility as well. And uh, so make sure that you take a look at the lecture outlines, watch the lecture videos. You'll see there's not that many videos this time, as I do present just a very brief amount of material there for Chapter 7. But again, both of them are due this uh, next Saturday, so just uh, keep that in mind there. Uh, other than that, I just wanted to say make sure you're watching those uh, lecture videos that really help you out to get more of the material, especially for Chapter 5 on STIs. I really have some interesting detail about some of those things that really wasn't clear in your book in a few places. So uh, everything you wanted to know, and maybe things you didn't want to know, and I always ask my students, maybe you're uh, going to be afraid to ever have sex again after you... Uh, go through that chapter, especially after some of the uh, images and pictures that you see, but it's part of life. It's going to happen to a lot of us as far as getting an infection there, one of these things, and it's nothing to be ashamed of, uh, but do take care of yourself and do look out for your sex partners as well because uh, that's not cool to uh, knowingly expose somebody to be irresponsible like that, so I'm sure you all get that. And uh, I've already been getting some of the discussion feedback for that uh, Chapter 5. And uh, some of you uh, really did share some personal things, and I hope you do too when you work on that Chapter 5 discussion. We'll see what it's about when you do it. Other than that, that's everything I wanted to say. Uh, hopefully I'll see some of you uh, next Monday, this coming Monday there at 3 o'clock for our live session. It'd be great to see some of you. Otherwise, have a good Halloween if you're going to do that uh, you know, Sunday there, or maybe Saturday night. You're going to have some fun. And uh, be careful and be safe. And if you need anything, reach out via the email, and I'll be glad to get back to you. Otherwise, take care. Until next time.